So these are products from Kors. I think that's how you pronounce it. But it's another all-natural brand. They have like a lot of different lines like rose and some kind of nut. And this one is specifically the pomegranate line. So this is the Kors um, pomegranate prescription face lips. It just came out at Sephora. And the only reason I wanted to upload the video is that I wanted to show you that if you bought it from the actual company's website, um, dot com. Then they're offering for this month you get a free mattifying primer, which is what comes in this kit. And you get a pretty good deluxe size. And you just have to spend $25 to get one. And this is $29.50 in and of itself. So this is 0.34 fluid ounces. It's supposed to apply a face and following foundation, follow with foundation. So these are the directions. It's a primer, so you would use it after your moisturizer and then before your foundation. It's supposed to be mattifying and it's coming in this like pomegranate line. It kind of sounds like a good idea for spring and everything. So this is what the little box kind of looks like. But Kors.com also did a really nice job in that I bought something else that I'm going to upload a video for. And so I spent like 25 times 2. So they gave me two actual samples, which was really nice. So this specifically is the Pomegranate Prescription Face and Lips Kit. It's only $29.50. And it comes with a bunch of goodies. So it's coming with a lip butter, which I was really interested in, especially in this way to like tube form. And it's also coming in a loop lip butter that comes in a jar. The only thing I don't like about jars is that I hate having to put my fingers in them. Comes with a nice little seal. And really nice and rich and creamy and smooth. And actually a decent amount of little color pigmentation. So just a really nice kind of pretty color for spring. And after staring at some of the beauty bloggers and their um, releases about new spring lines that are coming out, it's like perfect. So this one actually has a lot more pigmentation. And then this one's the tube, and this is the jar. You could probably build the jar up. It's just that it all depends on how much you put on your finger kind of thing. So it's nice because they are two different things. So this one is the Lip Butter Glaze in pomegranate. And they kind of just have a sweet smell. I wouldn't really say that they're a super... It doesn't really smell like strong pomegranate. Just kind of sweet. So then this is the actual lip butter in the jar. Really kind of creamy texture. But I kind of hate carrying jars around and I hate sticking my finger in jars. So this is something more like that will stay at home so I can actually wipe my finger off right away. But this one is great to throw in a purse. And the color again is just really cute for springtime slash, you know, end of winter or just a nice little perky pick me up. This is then the mattifying primer. So if you can see here, this one and this one, they're the same size. So you get a free one of these when you buy one of these, which is pretty good. So it looks like that. I'm surprised I didn't expect it to actually have a color to it. And so it actually has like kind of a creamy color to it. I don't know about that. I feel like if I blend it... So it does absorb into the skin really nice. It feels really smooth. And it's something I'm definitely willing to try. I think this would be really great for summer as it starts to warm up. Uh, 
And then this is the pomegranate mattifying treatment. And then this one you're supposed to apply to like the T-zone as needed. So I'm, I think this one is like stronger. And so this one is actually like a treatment treatment, like a serum kind of thing. So you could put this on before moisturizer or after a moisturizer. But it's just clear, goes on really smooth, feels more like a serum. And so this you would put on first, and then you would put the primer on over top of it, which is now blended in, and you can't even see it. The treatment has a little bit of a stronger smell. The primer doesn't really smell like a whole lot. <laughs>